Ever wonder what makes your smartphone work or lights up your home? The answer lies in a tiny invisible particle, the electron. But what exactly is an electron? Let's dive into the microscopic world and unravel the mystery of the electron. This minuscule particle, almost infinitesimal, is a fundamental building block of the universe. It's incredibly small, so small in fact, that if an atom were the size of a football stadium, the electron would be about as big as a pea. Electrons are found in atoms, the fundamental units of matter. Picture an atom as a miniature solar system with a nucleus at the center, akin to the sun, and electrons orbiting around it, just like planets. The nucleus is composed of protons and neutrons, but it's the electrons with their negative charge that play a crucial role in how atoms interact with each other to form the world we know. These electrons are the unsung heroes behind many of the conveniences we enjoy today. When you flip a light switch, it's electrons that flow through the wires, producing light. When you make a call on your smartphone, it's electrons that carry your voice across the world. They're even responsible for the chemical reactions in our bodies that keep us alive. However, electrons are not just tiny dots whizzing around the nucleus. They inhabit a fuzzier, more mysterious realm. Thanks to the weird and wonderful rules of quantum mechanics, electrons exist in a state of uncertainty, popping in and out of existence in different locations around the nucleus. While we can't pin down an electron's exact location, we can predict where it's likely to be. This is known as the electron cloud, a region around the nucleus where the electron is most likely to be found. It's this cloud that defines the shape and size of the atom. So electrons are the tiny particles that make up everything around us, and without them, life as we know it wouldn't exist. They're the unsung heroes that power our world, existing in a realm that defies our everyday understanding, and yet, they're integral to every aspect of our lives. It's truly a testament to the incredible complexity and wonder of the universe we live in. Now that we know what electrons are, let's delve a little deeper. How do these tiny particles behave? Imagine a bustling city at rush hour, with cars zipping around in a seemingly chaotic manner. That's a bit like the world of electrons in an atom. Electrons are constantly in motion, orbiting the nucleus of an atom at incredible speeds. But unlike cars in a city, electrons don't follow a set path. Instead, they move in areas around the nucleus known as orbitals, which are more like probabilities of where an electron might be at any given time. Now let's talk about the charge of an electron. An electron carries a negative charge, and this has a significant impact on how it behaves. Just like how opposite ends of a magnet attract each other, the negative charge of an electron is attracted to the positive charge of the atomic nucleus. This attraction keeps the electron in its orbital, preventing it from simply flying off into space. But that's not all. The negative charge of an electron also influences how it interacts with other particles. For instance, when two electrons come close to each other, their negative charges repel each other. This is why electrons spread out in an atom instead of clumping together in one spot. And there's more. Electrons also have a property called spin, which might sound like they're doing a little dance around the nucleus. But electron spin is actually a quantum property that's crucial to many phenomena, including magnetism and the structure of atoms. In a nutshell, electrons are a lot like characters in a grand cosmic play, with their own roles, attributes, and behaviors. They zip around at high speeds, they repel each other, and they're attracted to the positively charged nucleus. They even have a spin, adding another layer of complexity to their character. As you can see, electrons are fascinating particles with unique behaviors, all thanks to their negative charge. Understanding electrons is one thing, but seeing them in action is quite another. How do electrons fuel our modern world? Let's dive into the fascinating world of electrons and their role in electricity. At the heart of every electronic device, you'll find electrons hard at work. From the light bulbs illuminating our homes to the computers that facilitate our digital lives, it's all about the movement of electrons. Picture this. Electrons are on a never-ending journey, constantly moving and jumping from one atom to another. This movement is what we call an electric current. It's comparable to water flowing through a river. The water molecules, like our electrons, are in constant motion, creating a current. Now, imagine a wire. It's packed with atoms, each one hosting a party of electrons. When a voltage is applied at one end of the wire, it's like a signal at the party. 
the electrons start moving. They shuffle from one atom to the next, creating a flow of charge. This is the essence of an electric current. But how does this current light up a bulb or power a computer? Well, the flow of electrons carries energy. In a light bulb, this energy is transformed into light and heat. In a computer, it's converted into different forms of energy that allow you to surf the web, play games, or write emails. Electrons are also the stars of the show in switches and routers in networking. They carry the information as an electrical signal across the network. When you send an email or stream a video, electrons are racing through the network, carrying your data from one point to another. In a nutshell, these tiny particles are quite the workhorses. They are the invisible force that powers our modern world, and their ceaseless movement is what brings life to our electronic devices. So every time you switch on a light or charge your phone, remember, you've got electrons to thank. Electrons are not just about powering our devices. They also play a vital role in the world of chemistry and materials. But how? Well, let's dive right into it. In the realm of chemistry, electrons are the primary actors. They participate in what's known as chemical reactions. These reactions occur when electrons are exchanged or shared between atoms. This exchange or sharing is what forms bonds, the glue that holds atoms together to create molecules. Think of it this way. Imagine you're at a party and you start to mingle. You share stories, exchange ideas, and form connections with the other guests. This is what electrons do, but on a microscopic scale. They mingle with other atoms, exchanging or sharing themselves, thus creating bonds and forming molecules. Now this is where it gets even more interesting. The way these electrons are arranged in an atom can significantly affect the properties of materials. It's like a game of musical chairs. The number of chairs or energy levels in an atom determines how many electrons can sit and where they can sit. For example, metals are good conductors of electricity because they have a lot of free electrons that can move around easily. On the other hand, insulators like rubber have their electrons tightly bound, making it hard for electricity to flow. Even the colors we see are a result of how electrons absorb and emit light. When light hits an object, its electrons absorb energy, jump to a higher energy level, then fall back down, releasing energy in the form of light. The color of that light depends on how much energy the electrons release. So you see, the magic of electrons goes beyond just powering our devices. They are the architects of the microscopic world, shaping the properties of materials, creating the diverse range of substances we encounter every day, and even giving color to our world. From the water we drink to the air we breathe, electrons are at the heart of it all. Electrons, they're everywhere, doing everything, but we hardly ever notice them. They truly are the unsung heroes of our world. We've journeyed through the mysterious realm of these subatomic particles, understanding their unpredictable behavior, their integral role in electricity, and their profound impact on chemistry and materials. From powering our homes to orchestrating the dance of molecules, electrons are the silent puppeteers of our universe. Next time you enjoy a cool breeze from your electric fan or admire a beautiful crystal, remember the humble electron that makes it all possible. With that, we've come to the end of our journey into the world of electrons, your time and curiosity are greatly appreciated. If you found value in this exploration, do consider sharing it. Maybe your friends, peers, or family members are also intrigued by the microscopic marvels of electrons. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more fascinating insights into the world around us. We have so much more to learn together. Remember, knowledge is power.